Two things are infinite, the universe and human stupidity. And I'm not sure about the universe. Learn from yesterday. Live for today. Hope for tomorrow. The important thing is not to stop questioning. A man should look for what is and not for what he thinks should be. If you want your children to be intelligent, read them fairy tales. If you want them to be more intelligent, read them more fairy tales. Look deep into nature, and then you will understand everything better. I love to travel, but I hate to arrive. Life is like riding a bicycle. To keep your balance, you must keep moving. We cannot solve our problems with the same thinking we used when we created them. He who can no longer pause to wonder and stand wrapped in awe is as good as dead. His eyes are closed. Logic will get you from A to Z. Imagination will get you everywhere. The hardest thing to understand in the world is the income tax. I am enough of an artist to draw freely upon my imagination. Imagination is more important than knowledge. Knowledge is limited. Imagination encircles the world. Coincidence is God's way of remaining anonymous. Invention is not the product of logical thought, even though the final product is tied to a logical structure. In the middle of difficulty lies opportunity. Weakness of attitude becomes weakness of character. I am by heritage a Jew, by citizenship a Swiss, and by makeup a human being, and only a human being, without any special attachment to any state or national entity whatsoever. From the standpoint of daily life, however, there is one thing we do know, that we are here for the sake of each other. Above all, for those upon whose smile and well-being our own happiness depends, and also for the countless unknown souls with whose fate we are connected by a bond of sympathy. Many times a day, I realize how much my outer and inner life is built upon the labors of my fellow men, both living and dead, and how earnestly I must exert myself in order to give in return as much as I have received. Never memorize something that you can look up. The world is a dangerous place to live, not because of the people who are evil, but because of the people who won't do anything about it. If you can't explain it to a six-year-old, you don't understand it yourself. Intellectuals solve problems. Geniuses prevent them. There are only two ways to live your life. One is as though nothing is a miracle. The other is as though everything is a miracle. In matters of truth and justice, there is no difference between large and small problems, for issues concerning the treatment of people are all the same. The human spirit must prevail over technology. Concern for man and his fate must always form the chief interest of all technical endeavors, 
Never forget this in the midst of your diagrams and equations. When you are courting a nice girl, an hour seems like a second. When you sit on a red hot cinder, a second seems like an hour. That's relativity. The gift of fantasy has meant more to me than my talent for absorbing positive knowledge. Any fool can know. The point is to understand. No amount of experimentation can ever prove me right. A single experiment can prove me wrong. Try not to become a man of success. Rather, become a man of value. A person starts to live when he can live outside himself. You never fail until you stop trying. Common sense is the collection of prejudices acquired by age 18. Everything must be made as simple as possible, but not simpler. The measure of intelligence is the ability to change. Information is not knowledge. All that is valuable in human society depends upon the opportunity for development accorded the individual. Anyone who has never made a mistake has never tried anything new. I speak to everyone in the same way, whether he is the garbage man or the president of the university. Once we accept our limits, we go beyond them. When you trip over love, it is easy to get up, but when you fall in love, it is impossible to stand again. Education is what remains after one has forgotten what one has learned in school. The tragedy of life is what dies inside a man while he lives. I believe in intuitions and inspirations. I sometimes feel that I am right. I do not know that I am. Love is a better master than duty. I never made one of my discoveries through the process of rational thinking. If I were not a physicist, I would probably be a musician. I often think in music. I live my daydreams in music. I see my life in terms of music. A human being is a part of the whole called by us universe, a part limited in time and space. He experiences himself, his thoughts and feeling as something separated from the rest a kind of optical delusion of his consciousness. This delusion is a kind of prison for us, restricting us to our personal desires and to affection for a few persons nearest to us. Our task must be to free ourselves from this prison by widening our circle of compassion to embrace all living creatures and the whole of nature in its beauty. Few are those who see with their own eyes and feel with their own hearts. Without deep reflection, one knows from daily life that one exists for other people. Imagination is the highest form of research. Time is an illusion. I must be willing to give up what I am in order to become what I will be. Great spirits have always encountered violent opposition from mediocre minds. Energy cannot be created or destroyed. It can only be changed from one form to another. Play 
is the highest form of research. Reading, after a certain age, diverts the mind too much from its creative pursuits. Any man who reads too much and uses his own brain too little falls into lazy habits of thinking. I would teach peace rather than war. I would inculcate love rather than hate. Student is not a container you have to fill, but a torch you have to light up. I cannot imagine a God who rewards and punishes the objects of his creation, whose purposes are modeled after our own. A God, in short, who is but a reflection of human frailty. Neither can I believe that the individual survives the death of his body, although feeble souls harbor such thoughts through fear or ridiculous egotisms. The fear of death is the most unjustified of all fears, for there's no risk of accident for someone who's dead if you want to live a happy life, tie it to a goal, not to people or things. If A is success in life, then A equals X plus Y plus Z. Work is X, Y is play, and Z is keeping your mouth shut. The true sign of intelligence is not knowledge, but imagination. Wisdom is not a product of schooling, but of the lifelong attempt to acquire it. Peace cannot be kept by force. It can only be achieved by understanding. It is the supreme art of the teacher to awaken joy and creative expression and knowledge. It is in my view that the vegetarian manner of living, by its purely physical effect on the human temperament, would most beneficially influence the lot of mankind. The only sure way to avoid making mistakes is to have no new ideas. Unthinking respect for authority is the greatest enemy of truth. Do not grow old, no matter how long you live. Never cease to stand like curious children before the great mystery into which we were born. Truth is what stands the test of experience. If most of us are ashamed of shabby clothes and shoddy furniture, let us be more ashamed of shabby ideas and shoddy philosophies. It would be a sad situation if the wrapper were better than the meat wrapped inside it. The only source of knowledge is experience. It is my conviction that killing under the cloak of war is nothing but an act of murder. If I were to remain silent, I'd be guilty of complicity. Let every man be respected as an individual, and no man idolized. The most beautiful thing we can experience is the mysterious. It is the source of all true art and all science. He to whom this emotion is a stranger, who can no longer pause to wonder and stand wrapped in awe, is as good as dead. His eyes are closed. Life isn't worth living unless it is lived for someone else. Force always attracts men of low morality. I do not believe that civilization will be wiped out in a war fought with the atomic bomb. Perhaps two-thirds of the people of the Earth will be killed. Small is the number of them that see with their own eyes and feel with their own hearts. 
As our circle of knowledge expands, so does the circumference of darkness surrounding it. Our separation from each other is an optical illusion. It is strange to be known so universally and yet to be so lonely. He who joyfully marches to music in rank and file has already earned my contempt. He has been given a large brain by mistake, since for him the spinal cord would suffice. The devil has put a penalty on all things we enjoy in life. Either we suffer in health, or we suffer in soul, or we get fat. The attempt to combine wisdom and power has only rarely been successful, and then only for a short while. We should take care not to make the intellect our God. It has, of course, powerful muscles, but no personality. Imagination is everything. It is the preview of life's coming attractions. Never do anything against conscience, even if the state demands it. This is Catalyst. Stay inspired.